The Wagner March on Moscow is one of the most publicly documented incidents of the Ukraine conflict. More than 130 videos have been verified by Sky News and the Center for Information Resilience. The journey began in the southern city of Rostov-on-Don, Russia's logistics hub for its operations in Ukraine. This video shows the arrival of Prigozhin's troops. Armed Wagner soldiers, tanks and armoured vehicles took up positions in the city centre early on Saturday. Around the same time, Prigozhin shared footage of himself inside the Russian military HQ. We are in the штабе, 7 часов 30 минут утра, под контролем военные объекты Ростова, в том числе аэродром, самолеты, которые уходят для боевой работы, уходят штатно, проблем никаких нету, санитарные борта уходят, проблем нет. Все, что делается, это мы взяли под контроль, чтобы штурмовая авиация не наносила удары по нам, а наносила по украинцам. Later, this clip was filmed at a car dealership on the outskirts of Voronezh city. Men in green fatigues, thought to be Wagner fighters, fire what looks like an anti-aircraft missile. The missile appears to be aimed at a Russian military helicopter. This video shows a helicopter, possibly the same one, narrowly evading being hit by a rocket. It only just misses the person behind the camera. This clip shows large military trucks in Moscow's Kamovniki district on Friday evening. Here, Russian security forces formed roadblocks in the city's Yasaneva district on the Saturday. 